Hello everybody. This is C4 Explorer. And today, I and my buddy Oysterhead is up ahead of me. Have found this little we can't figure what out what this might have been. This might have been like a repair shop or something. We found our way into into it. And so we're just kind of looking around at all the random stuff that's laying around in here. There's quite a bit of pretty cool uh, leavings. You see there's a big hole in the roof. We actually debated, when we, we've done another very successful explorer that Oyster had found today. Um, Little factory, which I haven't done a video of yet. It's it's usually really hard to do a video when you're uh, when you're with somebody exploring with somebody. But um, we found this place was also apparently abandoned. And decided to take some pictures and stuff. And then I was like, I want to do a video in this place. There's like a lot of cool things everywhere. Hey, did you see this, uh, the hook up here? What's that? Did you see the hook up here? What's that? The chain fall or hook or whatever oh, that, yeah. the winch or whatever they call it. It's pretty cool. Yeah, this is one of these places that we uh, couldn't figure out if it was still active or not. But coming in here, it looks like it, it hasn't been used in a long time. Fortunately, we didn't encounter any people so far. So, of course, we had to come in and look around. over this way. I'm sure I'm going to mess up doing this video, but uh, just, I just wanted to kind of do a tour of this room, all these machines and whatnot that I don't really have a name for for some of this stuff. Stamp press maybe. This looks to be an old incinerator. Just all, any manner of things just laying all over the place here. Really fascinating. Got this old utility truck here, and this thing. I don't, I'm not entirely sure what this was. It, it looks kind of like a hot air balloon or something, or a, I don't know what the do set is. That is pretty cool. And of course, anybody who wants to, to leave something in the comments, if you know what it is, I'm I'm always open to education. Let me know. Um. I guess you can't know everything, even though Google makes everybody geniuses. Um, <laughs> some of this stuff, I mean, like that, I know that's like a seed spreader. And some of this stuff uh, I've just never really seen before. Or... This big tractor here, this is cool. Anything fascinating in there? Yeah, the 20 
Oh, nice. <laughs> That's another hard thing to do is to take a video of a place that You've never been to before because you're, of course, like looking around. I want, you know, I got, we, we got some pictures here a little bit ago with uh, our um, cell phones before we actually grabbed all our equipment. But obviously, there's a lot to see in here. But I couldn't not, you know, do a video of this place. This is kind of unique. I've never really been in a place like this um, as far as abandoned area because I do a lot of hospitals and blah 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 oh wow let's see he's in the office that was a let's see we got some ladders Ingersoll Rand Another drill press over there. This looks like a a lathe. A little bit closer to that. Um, I'm not going that way though. Oh, here's the office. Okay. I think. Oh wow. That is cool. There's like a machining lathe or something. Once again, leave it in the comments if I'm wrong, you know, that's okay. <laughs> I have no problem being further educated if need be. Uh, another industrial drill press, that's cool. Tool and die. Doesn't that sound ominous? Bank power. Oh, okay. There's the. Oh, there's the oyster head. I thought he saw from the distance. Different something. Oh, oh. Squeeze through here. Let's see, I don't want to call out the. Name of anything? Oh, I probably do, but there we go. <laughs> go back in there and check out the nuts and bolts on the wall. I love it. Where at? You can't put it. Let's see, nuts and bolts on the wall. Oh, oh. <laughs> I think I'm missing it. You say it's over there? <laughs> Oof. Over here. Oh, 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 I got you. Sweet. <laughs> Let's see. Okay. Let it a little bit further in. It wasn't in this room. Oh, are you talking about, oh, right here? Yeah. Holy crap. <laughs> yeah, this is like any size for washers. Wow. The hole. Supply room in here. 
way. It'd take forever to go through all this stuff. We kind of debated when we first came in and wondered if this might have been a chop shop or something. I mean, it's it's unlikely, but I guess it's possible. It might have just been like a repair depot for company vehicles, machine shop. I'm not entirely sure. Now we got first aid kit. Oh yeah, we looked in that room, there wasn't much in there. Huh. Hey, did you see the calthamites? What? Up on the ceiling, they have, we have all these like kind of calthamites up here. Pretty cool. And then you got the uh, building boogers on the floor where they're collecting. Look at that, y'all. Calthamites. Which I've seen in a number of buildings. Uh, usually like calcium and lime deposits that leach out of concrete, uh, they're defined as a stalactite that appears in a non-cave-like environment. I've seen them. A couple schools that I've been to, and oh, we got an assembly line, part of one over here. Um, hospitals and stuff. They, of course, they tend to appear in abandoned places, been unused for a while. Got a stamp press or something? I'm not sure what that is. This place just gets bigger and bigger. We didn't realize how how huge this, this was. When we first got here. Alright. I'll tell you what, folks. Um, I think... I'm going to get back to taking pictures. I have quite a bit more of this place to visit. Um, I hope you all enjoyed this video. I hope you don't feel like I'm ripping you off. Um, this is kind of a short video, honestly. Uh, and there, there's still quite a bit more to see. I, I mean, I don't know what else specifically is in some of these other rooms. But I wanted to show you some of the more interesting stuff that I've found while we've been walking around this place. Yeah, maybe we'll walk around a little bit more. Now it looks like a what a concrete cutter. to this place. This place is gigantic. I mean, like the place we went to earlier was huge, too. It was an old uh, textile mill that uh, we sure had, like I said, he, he discovered looking around on Google Maps. And uh, so we, we're going to try our luck. Uh, our last explore session, we had a good time, but we just couldn't get into a few of the places we wanted to get into. And uh, this time we struck real lucky. So, pallet jack. I've used those more than a more than a couple times. We got a divided highway sign off in the distance, sitting there.
I hope some of these images are coming out. I'm kind of I'm, I'm speeding through here a little faster than I'd like to do. Um, like I said, I want to try to get some good pictures, but I don't want to hold us up for too long. We have a few other places we might have on our agenda for today. That's some plow uh, harrows, right? Are those called harrows? Uh, there's oyster head off in the distance. This place is really cool. <laughs> it's just like everything is here. There's a road sign uh, over back behind me. A divided highway sign, I believe. Oh, nice. I got a red golf cart. And a couple uh, pugs, I think. A what room? Oh, nice. I'm going to have to check that out. Oh, they got the little girly, uh, the, the girly silhouette decal on the side of this card over here. <laughs> uh, let's go see a paint booth. <laughs> what is this? What the carrier air conditioner unit? Maybe. Let's go check out the paint booth. Oh, that's a thermometer. I thought it was a clock. Huh. Intriguing. I think this is this what he I think this was what he was talking about right here. Huh. Cool. Old pack of cigarettes on the floor. Oh it's yeah, all this dust. I'm not wearing the best mask in the world, but I got my mask on. The space helmet. <laughs> not really a space helmet. <laughs> wow. This is an impressive place. I got what is this a generator engine? It looks like. Whatever this is, some sort of a press or something. And that appears to be another Jenny. Me and Jenny was just like peas and carrots. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Gotta do my corny dad humor. Walking around here. I got bathrooms. Yeah, oh, this is cool. It's got like a little 
part of a podium or something. It has some cool decorations. It has a duck. Let's see if I can get over. Okay, I should have just gone around the other way, y'all. Oh, I think we were just over here, weren't we? Might have been. Probably passed by it. There's an ancient. Pretty neat. All right, folks. Uh, I'm going to show you the duck booth or the duck thing that I was talking about. Nice uh, woodwork on that. Cool looking. Oh. Podium facade or whatever it is. All right, folks, um, I think I'm going to go ahead and uh, take my leave and go try to take some more pictures. Um, I hope you all enjoyed this video. Like I said, this is a this is a new place for us. We're surprised as you all are. <laughs> um, we had no idea what this was going to be like in here. Um, so I hope you all enjoyed it. And, of course, feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. Oh, yeah, we did come this way. And... Uh, I'm going to go find my buddy, which I think he's over there. Um, so, of course, I want to thank you all for watching. And, uh, you know, I appreciate all your support and everything. I appreciate uh, appreciate everything my viewers do, even if it's just like somebody randomly checking out one video or something. So, um, I will see you all next time. This has been C4 Explorer with my buddy Oysterhead at an abandoned some sort of machine shop storage area thing that we don't quite know what it is but it has a lot of cool stuff in it so until next time y'all thanks again for watching and i'll see you then goodbye